Hi, I'm Jeff Bleich, the United States Ambassador to Australia. Welcome to the U.S. Embassy. I've been here for two years now with my family, and we've had a chance to travel all over Australia. We've been to every state and territory, out to regional Australia, and also to all the major capitals uh, several times now. And the one thing that this has confirmed for us is that we truly have no better friend in the world than Australia. We are working on every major issue today, including making sure that uh, we have free trade in the region and strengthen both of our economies, making sure that the sea channels are free and safe, making sure that uh, the risks to our nations, either from climate change or from nuclear proliferation, uh, are reduced and that we work together on every possible challenge, um, not only in the spirit of um, protecting ourselves and promoting ourselves, but also for making it a better world. Some of the things that we've done in the past two years have included having the President of the United States out here to announce uh, an exciting new free trade agreement, the Trans-Pacific Partnership, will, which will have the U.S. and Australia as two of the key anchor parties of a nine uh, nine country agreement, which will help promote trade and reduce barriers and make it easier for all of us to get the best stuff that we're looking for around the region uh, and make sure that everyone's treated fairly and that every country will, will prosper from this. Another thing that we've done is looked at where our forces are in the world and making sure that we have our chess pieces in the right place for a dynamic world ahead. And that means uh, more collaboration, more training together, more exercises, and also more partnering with all of our friends in the region. A third thing that we're doing is making sure that we're looking out for human rights. And that includes protecting uh, the rights of those in the island nations who are subject to domestic violence, also looking out to ensure that there's food, water, and energy security in the region, and just ensuring that um, every country understands the importance of a free press, freedom of speech, freedom of religion, and the opportunity for every person to participate in the selection of their government. So with that, we have uh, exciting new initiatives. We have a big year ahead. And I look forward to working with all of our Aussie mates here in Australia and getting to know more of you as we travel even further around the country. Thank you.